Hi, my name is Taryn, and I'm going in for the gastric bypass. For those of you who don't know me, um, I'm Taryn, I live in Chicago, Illinois, and I'm currently in Michigan visiting my family. So here I am trying to do some kind of vlog about it, mostly for myself, but also for anyone else who's interested in getting this surgery. I am five days into my preoperative diet for this surgery. What that means is for every surgeon, they have different rules that you have to follow before surgery. Um, my specific surgeon wanted to make sure that your liver shrinks enough for them to not have any complications during surgery. So for the past five days and for another four, I am on a 1,000 calorie a day diet. I feel pretty good. Since Wednesday, I've lost eight pounds. And I'm not sure if my scale is being weird or what. But five pounds seems like a little bit too much to me. But at the same time, I'm going in for the gastric bypass and I'm going to be losing a lot more than that. I'm 20 and my highest weight was almost 280 pounds. And that was back in September. Um, since September, I've started doing different things to help my diet out. I've cut out anything that contains high fructose corn syrup which means no soda, no candies, no <laughs> pretty much everything. And from October to January, I lost 15 pounds. Unfortunately, this past January, January 17th, my mother passed away. And she was going to be an extreme supporter in this journey for myself, and she was planning on helping me out a lot. So not having her here has been pretty rough, but my dad's been doing a great job, and I'm very thankful for him. So, I just wanted to do something quick to talk about what I'm doing to let people know who I didn't get to tell in person. Um, I went through a phase where once I had the date locked down, for about a month I was kind of maybe not ashamed, but I was really disappointed in myself. It wasn't that I was disappointed in myself for making this decision, but I felt like the past several years of trying to raise my self-esteem and be more confident would have been all for naught. I'm an extremely confident person, I'm not afraid of a lot of things, and I'm not very self-conscious. I felt like it was almost a betrayal of all the work I've done to be proud of who I am and to accept what I looked like, only to go in for the surgery. It took me about two months to come to terms with that, mostly because I'm not doing this for vanity reasons. I'm not doing this to look good. I'm doing this to feel good. I'm I'm sick of my knees hurting. I'm sick of my ankles buckling. I'm 20. I can recover a lot better than someone who's in their 60s and are doing this to save their life. I'm doing this to prevent myself from getting to that stage. The surgery's happening this Thursday, and I'm not as nervous as I thought I would be. I'm more excited for the year out and how I'm going to be in a year. Especially if I've lost eight pounds in five days just from dropping to a thousand calories a day. I can't even imagine how much I'm going to lose in the next year. And it's going to be a lot of hard work, but I hope I'm ready for it. And I, if you have any questions, I will try to answer a majority of them.